totally unscheduled Wheelie Fun Pops. I'm Amy and the voice from over there is Peter as always. Uh, don't forget to check us out on social media, on Instagram and Facebook. Uh, thank you very much. And don't forget to subscribe. Just, you know, a friendly reminder uh, before we get into things. Uh, thank you very much to all of our returning subscribers. We love you. And uh, welcome to newcomers and please stay and hope you enjoy the video. This time we are investigating the world of BAM! There's an exclamation mark. You have to say BAM! And this is the BAM Gamer box. The first, I believe, of yeah. its kind. Ooh. So, um, this one is sealed and uh, I'm going to get himself to cut the tape. Please cut the tape. Uh, in this box, we may find items from uh, the game Injustice 2. Zelda, Chronicles of Zelda, Legend, Legend, of, Ooh, Zelda. Legend of Breath of the Wild. Legend of Zelda, Breath of the Wild, and God of War, uh, which is. Ooh, so exciting for me. Not because I played the game, but because. Um, Kratos? 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 is voiced by one of my all-time absolute favourite actors, Christopher Judge. You would know him better as Tilk from Stargate. And I've met him and he's lovely. So there. There's that. Anyway, ooh, box full of goodies with, ta with a lovely paper on top so I can see nothing. I can see nothing at all. So I shall, I shall, ooh. Oh. So, in this box, yes. there's a guaranteed signed Funko Pop. Oh, yes. Gar well, the completely spaced there. Guaranteed signed Funko Pop. But we don't know who, what, what it's from. What franchise. What franchise it's from. It's not actually guaranteed to be from the franchises advertised on the box. No. So, ugh. Um, and there is also the possibility of a signed print from Mike Tyson's Punch Out, signed by Mike Tyson. There's all kinds of little bits of paper or card okay. or something. So I'm going straight in with one of the little bits of card. So here we go. Uh, what is this? Oh, oh, it's a congratulations. Oh, artist selected card. This is an authentic BAM fan art card featuring a unique sketch from one of our featured artists. This card is part of a set of two and a bigger set of 12. Collect both cards to make the set. It is, it is, I'm Batman. I'm Batman. I can't do it. Can you do it? I'm Batman. No, never mind. Anyway, ooh, that's, that's cool. That's cool. So yeah, collect a card and it's signed by the artist, Jason Miller. So, ooh. Right, let's have another look at one of these other bits of paper in here, or whatever they may be. Uh, this is, ooh, this is a BAM match three and win a giveaway thingy. Peter, do you want to scratch away? I have a scratch. You have a scratch. In there. Apparently, according to, um, who is it? Uh, blah, what's his name? Franchise, Franchise kicks. kicks. Nobody ever wins anything on the scratch cards. He doesn't know anyone that's ever won. He doesn't know anyone that's ever one. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, we have a level up card. I ooh. have no idea what this means, but it's exciting. This means that we have an increased rarity variant on one of our items. Okay, so uh, one of the boxes, oh, one of the boxes, one of the items in your box is a variant. That means that there are fewer made or, than the regular item. Please check your insert to see which one you got. <sighs> we didn't win. Oh, we didn't win. Oh well, never mind. Ah, uh, right. Ooh, uh, ooh, oh, uh, this feels like a pin, and it is a pin, and it is a Mike Tyson. It is a Mike Tyson pin. Look at the Mike Tyson pin. Ooh, he looks very boxery and 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 angry and yeah. That is. That is a. 
It's it's all sort of jaggedy around the edge. Is that supposed to be from a game? From a boxing yeah, it's game? from an old, um, from Mike Tyson's Punch-Out. Oh, I didn't know which that. Which I think was Nintendo. It's really heavy. It's really, really heavy. Connect collectible enamel pin. This pin has a limited release. Yes, so Mike Tyson pin. There, I don't know if you can see that. Right, You're very heavy. Feel the weight of that. That weighs a ton, doesn't it? Does. Very heavy. Okay, oh, oh, that's making a noise. I hope that's not broken. It's rattling. Oh. Ooh, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a shield. It's, it's a Zelda shield. It's a Zelda, 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 Zelda. It's Zelda, isn't it? I think that's Zelda. I think that's Zelda. Zelda. Oh, oh, I'm so sorry if I'm wrong. Um, ooh, Zelda shield. Let's have a look at that. What is it? It's got a D ring on the back. Does it, that, does that make it, what? Well, that's not a, that's not a, uh, look at that. Ooh, that is nice. I likey. That is very geeky and I like you very much. Um, I'm just a bit confused as to the attachment at the back. It's, yeah. it's, 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 well, there's a cheat sheet which will tell yes, us later. Yes, I will, I will investigate cheat sheet and find out what this is. But whatever it is, it's, it's, it's well made and it's really heavy. It's not like tacky and cheap and, you know, just... It's, it's, look, Phil, have a look at that. It's, it's beautifully enamelled. It it's beautifully enamelled. That's a nice thing. That'd be a really yeah. great thing if, if um, you know, you had you were doing like a Zelda cosplay or something. But I, I think I would just, I think I would just wear it, to be honest, just as a really nice geeky thing. So, woo. Okay. I like this box. This is cool. We've never done one like this before. Ooh. This is our first ever band box. This is our first ever band box. This there, there is are more there's, on the way. there's how many items are supposed to be in this I box? I don't know. This is the this right. I, I'm not gonna be able to avoid this. Um this this is the pop. Okay, so here we it's go. It's wrapped in black paper, it's, you can avoid oh, it. Oh, I can avoid it. I'm gonna leave the pop till last because it's signed and it's very exciting. Um, so I'm going to leave it to last. So we're going to see other stuff. That's it, because I can feel other stuff. There's other stuff in here. Okay, uh, flat things. We have flat things. There are no more lumpy things. So just flat things. So what is this? Oh, Ooh, oh, Kratos print. oh, God wow. Of War print. Oh, wow. Look at that God of War print. The artwork is gorgeous. And who is this signed by? Uh, uh, it doesn't say who it's signed. I have to check on the cheat sheet who it's signed by. But it's it's really gorgeous artwork. Look at that. I mean, whether you like the game or not, that artwork is stunning. So we will find out who has signed it, but I'm really hoping it's Christopher Judge. I don't I think it will probably be the artist. Oh, oh. Right, okay, we have another thing that feels like a, a possibly a print. This is, this is another print. This is, is another signed print. This is another signed another print. Another signed print. Okay, and this is uh, fan art from our fan art collection is exclusive to BAM. Boxes will be hand signed by the artist and guaranteed to be authentic. So this has been signed by the artist, and this is uh, isn't isn't that, that Halo? Be, I don't know. I'm I guessing it would be in just Injustice Two, which is the other franchise. Right. But with maybe well, it's one of their mashup prints that they seem to have started doing. Yeah, it it does seem to be two yeah. two different. So I'd be interested to find out what is going on there but the art yet again i don't like it as much as the god of war one i'm gonna i'm gonna be honest um but it's really really good artwork um and if these are series that you are into then it's it's just a really cool thing to have up on the wall so um yep i think that's the end of it i think there's there's we're down to the cheat sheet yep yeah, yeah. we're down to the cheat sheet which I'm not going to look at yet. Oh, lovely black paper. Look at obsessing over paper. 
silly. Right. Here's what we've all been waiting for. Oh. It's in a protector. Yes, it is yeah. in a protector. Right side up, upside down. Right side up. Facing forwards? Yeah. Okay, guys, here we go. What did we get? What is this? What is this? This is... This is Crash Bandicoot. Wow. Okay. Crash Bandicoot. Well, that's that's a cool pop. I only I only ever played Crash Bandicoot a few times, but this is a Beckett certificate. So this is this is, this is an authenticated uh, signature, and it's got the Beckett sticker. Ooh, I don't know if you can see the Beckett sticker on the side there, and also on the back you've got your Beckett certificate of authenticity. Um, I mean, tell me about this pop, Peter. What do we know about this pop? Um, the, the pop is uh, Tiny Tiger from Crash Bandicoot, as it says on the box. Yeah. Um, it's a widely available pop. Uh. It, it's TPD value is £9 unsigned. Right, unsigned. But this one is signed. And we have to find out who signed it. So, cheat sheet... Here I come. Right, what do we have here? Oh, exclusive savings for you on Beckett Authenticating Services. Right, well, that might come in handy one day. You never know. Okay, let's have a look what we have here. Bam Gamer Volume 1. Sorry. <clears throat> Bam Gamer Volume 1. Uh, vo volume 5 box. What? Okay, uh, this is Bam's first release of the Gamer Box. The first 250 Bammers will receive a limited edition coin. Oh, we didn't get that. Uh, while the first thousand Bammers will receive one or other of a mashup print. Oh, of Master Chief and Nathan Drake. I was right. It was Master Chief. Haha, <laughs> I like it when I'm right. So uh, we have the, uh, blah, 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 the fan art pin. So jab, jab, hook. Artist Brian Romero features the 1987 Punch Out, and these pins are a knockout. Uh, keep an eye out for the other two variant pins. So we got a variant. We got the uh, Mike Tyson. Yeah, sorry, blank there for a moment. Uh, oh, this is a prop replica. This, this is a prop replica, and this is from Legend of Zelda. Get your hands on Link's. Hylian Shield. So this is this is Link's Shield. Oh, I thought it was Zelda. Um, artist Select Card. Artist Jason Miller once again hits the nail right on the head with this awesome Injustice Batman illustration. Be on the lookout for the variant as well. If you if you got the BAM box and you got the variant, I'd love to see what it looked like. That'd be great. Okay, and we have the fan art print. Artist Matt Aiken depicts the fan favourite Kratos and his son in this God of War fan art print. Keep an eye out for the variant. So I'm um, I'm guessing that the print was signed by the artist, like you said. Not by Christopher Judge. Oh, never mind. We will meet again one day. Maybe. Um, and the autographed Fungo. We are proud to present you Crash Bandicoot Funko Pops signed by Brennan, Brennan O'Brien, the original voice of Crash Bandicoot. Oh! Be on the lookout for the variant Funko Pops. Okay, cool. So, the original voice. That made a noise. Oh, no. It was <laughs> I put it down on the table and Link's shield made a you know, metal -y noise, and I thought I'd broken something. Uh, no. So, the this pop, uh, in itself, only, you know, basic retail price, but it's signed by the original voice artist, which is really cool. And voice artists, very, very underrated profession, but so brilliant. So brilliant. I would have loved to have been a voice artist. That would, that would, that, that just, ever since I was a kid and I watched, um, Miss, Mrs. Doubtfire and Robin Williams was doing his voiceover thing, I wanted to be a voiceover artist. So anyway, 
completely off track. Awesome pop. Uh, so, yes, do we have values on any of this stuff? Not really. I mean, the no. box has only just come out. So, so okay. I can so... check eBay for, for values, but they, they're going to be pretty much fluctuating at the moment. Yes, so no idea on values, but awesome. But for the price of the box... Which is what? Um, it works out at about £40, including shipping. £40, including shipping, got us a signed Funko Pop, two artist signed prints. Limited edition. Limited numbered edition, prints. numbered prints, which are, this one is awesome, I'm keeping this one. This one, I like it, but not enough to keep it. Um, and we have Lynx Shield, which I will be keeping and figuring out some way of being able to accessorise it in some way, because it's really cool. I like it. And the boxer, whose name is Mike, Mike Tyson. Tyson. Mike Tyson pin, which weighs a ton um, and is, is really cool if you like Mike Tyson. Personally, oh, I can't stand boxing. I really can't. Uh, just, yeah. Sorry, if you if you like it, then everybody has their own thing. That's great. I uh, it just makes my bones hurt watching it, so I can't. Um, I've gone off topic again. Pin, very cool, very high quality pin. And again, we have this awesome limited edition, uh, authentic BAM fan art card featuring a unique sketch from one of the featured artists and signed. So. Basically, a bunch of very cool geeky stuff. If geeky stuff is your thing, then Bam Box Gamer may well be your thing too. I will leave a link to Bam, Bam Box, or Bam, Bam or just the, the Bam Box, in the description for this video. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching this thing. Unboxing? Unboxing! It's not, it's been an unboxing. Yes, mystery box, unboxing. I hope you've enjoyed it anyway, and uh, if you have, please don't forget to leave us a comment, because we love comments, we do, even if it's to criticise, because criticism makes us grow and develop and stuff. Um, so, you get it, give us a like and a subscribe, and uh, hit the notification bell, because we will be putting up random videos at random times, because we've got so much to get through at the moment. It's insane. You would not believe the mountain of boxes that are piling up in my house. It's just... It's nuts, isn't it? Yeah. It's nuts. So anyway, random videos, so please do hit the notification bell so you don't miss a thing. Um, I've been Amy, he's been Peter, and we've been Willy Fun Pops. Bye for now!